One year and eight months after the terrible tool wrecked the Second Republic, the Buhari Ijagban Double Act was thrown out of office in a classical palace coup. According to Peter Inaro, unquote, Ijagban, the regime's Rottweiler, was in Mecca performing the Hajj, which left his mate, David Buhari, desperately exposed. Army Chief of Staff Major General Ibrahim Badamusi Babangida emerged as the new leader, supported by the coup announcer, Major General Sami Abacha, an enigmatic schema Nigerians will come to love to hate." Unquote. Disaffection with Buhari had been evident for months and his removal somehow was expected. At a parade like this, he and his colleagues survived at least one assassination attempt by 42 army officers. Well, Buhari has not delivered the goods. He has not uh, been able to decide on what to do with the detainees from Shehu Shigari's previous regime. Uh, he has not come up with a comprehensive economic policy. Uh, he has built himself into a corner. In the words of Peter Inara, unquote, the two terrors began to construct the Nigeria of their vision. Fascism without the Hitler street arm salute. Among their emphatic achievements was the execution of a female convict by a firing squad, a first by a military regime in Nigeria. The scope of state violence and the innovation of absurdly long prison sentences imposed by the courts frightened and disgusted most Nigerians. The regime shot itself in the foot when it recruited international brigands to carry out a gangland style operation coordinated by a Nigerian army major in London." Unquote. It is on record that Boris tribunals sentenced their victims to terms ranging from 100 to 600 years in jail. Even Buhari himself considered that Jacobo Danjuma, Orishabu Obasanjo, and Shou Yaradua were reportedly contributive to his rise to power. But Buhari is a lone ranger with little or no loyalty traits. After Buhari seized power, Shou Yaradua might have expected to have been consulted more widely or more frequently by his old friend that was the case in the matters of public policy. Even his two-time ADC and protege, the ex-major ex-colonel Mustafa Jokolo and later Emir of Gwandu, felt the relationship between Sheo Yaradua and Buhari had become one-sided. Unquote. I did not see what Buhari did for Sheo in return for all the things he did in sticking Sheo's neck out for him. Tafida thought Buhari's talents were being wasted as governor of Bruno State, so he made the minister of petroleum and the first chairman of the NNPC. Later, he made him military secretary over the grumblings of senior officers." Unquote. One of Fela's hit songs was based on the disappearance of 2.8 billion naira NNPC money that got stolen under Buhari's watch as petroleum minister and head of the NNPC in 1978. 2.8 billion naira, while money is the missing. 2.8 billion naira, while money is the missing. Then set up a quarry. They say money no lost you. They dabaru everybody. Under intense public pressure, the Shadari government, which shortly took over thereafter, from the military, set up a Senate probe which traced the money to a London Midland bank account belonging to Buhari, from where the money again got missing. It is not worthy that the value of 2.8 billion naira in 1978 was 3 billion dollars, or in today's naira value, 555 billion naira. The then Senate Majority Leader and Chairman of the Senate Pro Panel, Dr. Abubakar Onishola Saraki, revealed this discovery in an interview with Vera Ifudo of the Nigerian Television Authority, NTA. 
When Ifude reported this, she was sacked by the NTA. But the woman went to court and presented all the evidence and won in a case of wrongful dismissal. Saraki, until his death, never did whatever he told the lady in the interview.